So, yet again, it has been forever since I posted one of these vloggy videos. The important thing is, I did accomplish some of the goals that I set out for myself, which... For those of, I think it's 12 of you who watched the last video. Uh, I talked about needing to take care of myself. And that's what I did. You know, I relaxed. Begrudgingly relaxed. And... I had a good time. I relaxed a bit. I worried still, but me not worrying is, you know, I'm not breathing. Um, I did not accomplish exactly everything I had set out for. It was a bit hypocritical of some of the things that I said that, you know, I wasn't going to take into account what other people thought. I didn't realize it, but even attempting to create an audience with these vlogs and social media posts, that it, it is a force that is being applied to me that I feel like I owe. And it, I don't know. I feel like it was a little disingenuous or a little hypocritical is probably more accurate. I already used that word and that's probably more accurate. And I also feel like it was poor form, I guess, that when coming out of whatever state, depression, anxiety, whatever that I was dealing with over the summer, to be like, yeah, we're going to do this and we're going to do it by these days and do this. And, you know, hope for the best, I guess. And... It did not fulfill with what I wanted. I wanted to do a, a video like this every week. I wanted to have content created that wasn't this vlog, this personal storytelling and update of my life and my thoughts, but some actual other content posted before November. Um, and that didn't, that didn't quite happen the way I wanted it to. There was some technical issues. There was me being lazy issues. Me struggling with the anxiety of going back to school this quarter. Getting back into the flow of things. And it's okay. It's okay. It's not okay because those of who... Those of you who are watching and listening don't matter. It's it's okay. It was okay that I set up expectations for myself. And it's okay that I didn't succeed on all those expectations. This is because I was actually trying to do something. I was setting up goals for myself of what I wanted to try to accomplish. And I overshot some of the time limits. Uh, and things didn't just work out quite the way I wanted to. But I didn't give up. I'm still working on those things. And I will continue to work on those things. But I want to give this, this vlog, these Mythos' letters, a little more oomph to it all. Because it's important to me. It, it, it's, it's cathartic a bit. Um... I personally have difficulty talking to people, even people who are close to me. Now, I probably won't get into like super deep stuff that I'm dealing with or anything like that, but this is an outlet. It's an important outlet. Even if I don't do the things that I want to do with it, it's something I should try to strive for. Not just to expose the things that I'm doing to other people like updates about what projects I'm working on and things like that but even if nobody watches this I'm I'm putting myself out 
out there, making myself a bit more vulnerable. It in conjunction with uh, other things, uh, seeing like a therapist and trying to be better about opening up with friends. It's, it's all helpful. So, out of that weird, whatever that was, um, I do, I am working on a, how do I put this, kind of like a, a review-esque thing about movies and books, and I'm going to do another one of these in the next day or so. I've got some things coming up, but I'm going to incorporate what was supposed to be the pilot, the the initial episode that I was working on in Amethos' letter, uh, number 15, three of these, um, and kind of open up my working progress and, and talk about it a bit and kind of stop tinkering with that first bit and just move along, create a new pilot they, and show my work in progress. So stay tuned in the next few days. It's hopefully Sunday or Monday that'll be up. Um, but I wanted to get this one out first. I wanted to kind of just do something. I don't want to wait on... I'm putting a little more effort into that episode. Um, if, if you pay attention to, so far I've been posting a lot on Instagram. There's some using Instagram to post to Twitter and Tumblr and all that stuff. But I've been doing a lot of food prep, uh, dehydrate, dehydrating apples, dehydrating some habanero peppers, showing a little more, more of my uh, culinary exploration, plus recording the interesting pieces of media that I find and add to the library. Um, so if the people who are watching this are interested in uh, n more of the media stuff, let me know. Uh, I want to talk about more things, but I want I want to know what people are interested in. If people are interested in the food stuff, let me know. I want, I, I, I need questions. I need people to, I need to be engaged. I'm having difficulty just putting myself out there. And a couple engagements would be super helpful. Um, let's see. I don't, I don't want to, like, I got plans. I'm working on things, but I don't want to, like, be like, oh, man, this, this, I don't want to be shaky like I was two months ago on things that I'm working on. I am working on things. Um, tomorrow, uh, the house that I live in, the, the, uh, the group of people, we're throwing a house party. Um, me and one of my other roommates are making all the food, uh, tomorrow. <laughs> uh, and I will be mixing the drinks. So there will be some photos and videos of that posted up on the social media. Um, so that's something interesting to look forward to. Uh, also, if you live in the Vancouver, Washington, Portland, Oregon area, and you can get to Vancouver uh, in November, I believe it's the 9th and the 11th, I will be hosting a DD and d game, 3.5. If you're interested, let me know in the comments. Send me a private message, um, and I'll tell you what you need to do to build a character. Uh, I'm just kind of seeing people interested. Uh, I've been able to run some Star Trek role-playing games with some close friends. So, yeah, I've I've been doing stuff. Mostly taking care of me, but I'm getting out and putting things together. As for the 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 media review show that I'm kind of working on, I am looking for people who are interested in maybe learning some skills or who already have some skills and just want to do something. Um, who might want to help out on a shoot or two. Um, so if you're interested in that, let me know. 
Uh, if you're interested in things that I could talk about, the, the subject matters that I'm passionate about, that I have knowledge about, polyamory, uh, naturalism or nudism, humanism, human, humanist, humanist, I'm a secular humanist, so specifically that, but I, I do know the areas around it. Agnostic atheism, um, skepticism, the scientific method, uh, polyamory, I think I said that already. I don't know. Um, I'm, I'm very interested in uh, gender studies and sexual orientation and all, uh, how, how that works in our society. So if you're interested in any of those topics, let me know. Um, ask me a question. It'd be super helpful. Uh, until later in the next few days, I'll, I'll talk to you later.